Hello there, everyone. Welcome back. I am Bogmon. We are playing more of The Legend of Heroes Trails of Cold Steel. And we're about to find out who these three ladies are. Laura S. Arside. I'm Laura S. Arside, from the town of Lagram. It's a pleasure to make your acquaintance. Huh. Lagram? That's down on the southeastern outskirts of the Empire, isn't it? Correct. It's an old castle town on the shores of Lake Ebel. We're connected to the rest of the country by train, but other than that, it's a fairly remote region. Mm -hmm. hmm. That name sounds so familiar. It's probably one of those hated, hedonistic nobles that you hate. Wait, so your father would be... Yes, my father is Viscount Arsade, Lord of Lagram. Do you take issue with that? Uh, no, not at all. Do you? Yeah, because she's a lady. So not only you hate people based on their class, you're sexist. You monster. <laughs> Machias, was it? I can only speak for myself, but I don't feel I've ever done anything to bring shame upon myself in Adios's eyes. Adios? Okay. And I fully believe the same to be true of my father. Uh, please, I meant no offense. I'm... <laughs> Sorry if, if, if I... Um... You know, I didn't mean to offend you when I called you all stuck-up, hedonist, outdated, you know. Uh, say, I don't believe we've been introduced. Emma Milstein? I'm Emma Milstein. Like Laura, I come from a distant region of the Empire. I was only able to attend Thor's thanks to a scholarship, in fact. It's very nice to meet you. A scholarship? Hmm, indeed. Now that you mention it, our instructor did say yours was the top score on the entrance exam. <sighs> to think I was outdone. By a girl, no less. Whoa, buddy. <laughs> you must be quite the prodigy. <laughs> Maybe it seems like it now, but really, I'm not. I don't have any training in the martial arts either, so this is the weapon they recommended for me. Oh, the oh cool! You got an orbital staff too. Yours looks different from mine, though. Huh, so it does. I wonder if it's just cosmetic. Oh. Oh, the hate, the hate in her eyes. And yeah, what do you say? Don't say anything. It's... she needs to apologize to you, Reen. Hmm? Is something the matter? We're all acquainted now. It's only proper that you introduce yourself. Yeah, yeah, okay. That's a crazy looking bow. I'm Lisa uh, R. from Ruwer. R. that's... Ah... Uh, that is as suspicious as him going, hmm, am I a commoner? Hold on, let me take a long pause to consider it, and then I'll say, there is not any noble blood in my veins. Ooh, I wonder if you could be, I wonder if that counts. If you're a bastard from the royal family, is that, a, is that the same as being noble? It's a pleasure to meet almost oh. all of you. Yep. Uh, Elisa. Ruer, huh? What's it like living there? There's probably a new technological breakthrough every week. The Reinford Company's based in Ruer, and they're the largest heavy industry corporation on the continent, aren't they? I suppose they are. Uh, so, hey. Yeah, it thinks it started off I so well. I guess that bow must have been in that case you had with you when we first met, right? I've never seen one like it. Is there some kind of orbital mechanism built there, in? There we are. That's that's very good safe topic. There is, but I don't see how that's any of your oh, business. Oh, your class. Uh, Ouch. Um, yeah. Anyone got any ideas on what to do now? We've all run into each other wandering around. How about we stick together? I think that would be for the best. It's not safe for a group of girls to travel alone. Mm -hmm. You may require protect. You needn't be concerned about that. I was hiding this in my pocket. That is a map. Look at the length of that thing. That is bigger than she is. I don't mean to boast, 
but I'm confident my swordsmanship will be more than sufficient to protect us. For now, I think it's best to remain in separate groups. There are still two of us who remain unaccounted for. That's right. We still haven't run into that silver-haired girl. In that case, two teams means double the chance to find them. Two teams is double the coverage, and double the chance of crossing paths with our missing companions. How's that sound? I have no objections. So then, shall we be off? All right. <sighs> don't worry about it, guy. Reen, just don't worry about it. We'll see the four of you later, it. then. She's the one with the problem, not you. <sighs> she really doesn't seem like she's gonna let that go, does she? Yeah, well, that's her problem. It was clearly an accident. Everyone could see that. Yeah. But I don't suppose it makes any difference to her. That is very correct. That is why, Reen, like I said, don't worry about it. It's her problem, not yours. Still, is no one else worried about leaving a group of girls to fend for themselves in a place like this? Nope. This is, in fact, remarkably one of the first times I think I've actually encountered a, a character who's actually playing up this angle in the, in the game. There are four of us here. Perhaps one of us should go follow them. I don't think we have anything to worry about as long as Laura's with them. She really wears her skill on her sleeve. I doubt she drags around a sword that big just for show. It's certainly an enormous blade. I'd call it comically huge if it didn't look so dangerous. But at the end of the day, a lady is a lady. Oh, Machias. And a dick is a dick. She's taller and sturdier than I am. Though I admit it's still hard to believe anyone could swing that beast of a sword. I'll bet she can whip it around without breaking a sweat. The Arsite School of Swordsmanship serves as a general basis for the techniques used by knights throughout the Empire. And her father, the Viscount, is arguably the strongest swordsman in the country. People call him the Radiant Blade Master. I don't know. I've met some pretty famous sword masters. What about the Divine Blade? Well, I guess he's not a swordsman anymore. But I think we have the Divine Blade. Ah, uh, Cassius Bright, the most amazing man on the continent. I doubt any of the other students here could even stand their ground against her in combat, much less beat her. Wow. Interesting. I didn't know there were still roots of the old knightly styles alive in the Empire. You sure know a lot about this stuff, Reen. A hobby of yours? I'm a swordsman myself. I guess the lore sort of comes with the territory. Mm. At any rate, how about we pick up the search? Yes. I'm worried about that silver-haired girl, and we still need to track down Duke Alvarea's son, too. That's true. <laughs> I couldn't care less what happens to that pompous ass. <sighs> can rot down here. You can rot down here! <laughs> Come on, now. That's no way to treat someone you just met. Looks like the path splits. Which way do you think we should go? Let's go left. I feel a little wind blowing from the east. But the exit's that way. Then let's go left. All the more reason to go to where the exit is not. Ha! Ha! Now's our chance. We can do this. Go. Ha! Yeah. All right. Just stabbing should be more than sufficient for this. Right. Eat that. Go. Ha! All right. Ha! Ha! Mm -hmm. Is everybody Yay. okay? Is there treasure? Yeah. There seems to be a treasure chest here. Ooh, excellent. Tear chest. So that'll be your basic healing magic. Swap that for you. Um, who's got the next best ATS? You do. Nope. All right. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh, no. Oh, no. See, in the other games, you could try to uh, examine chests you'd already opened. 
and then have a little dialogue. But not in this game. It makes me... It makes me a little sad. In fact, in the other three games, um, the only time the chests didn't have any special dialogue was the chests that were literally in hell. Guess that means we're in hell. Oh. Let's take him out. Here we go. Uh, it's my turn. Oh yeah, right. There. Not gonna do much damage. It's my turn. Arcus, activate. <laughs> burn, baby, burn. My turn. Well, at least you do your full damage normally. That takes care of them. <laughs> Let's see, where am I? Alright. Huh? <sighs> eh? What's wrong? M more monsters? No, not monsters. It's... Ninja Girl? You're pretty sharp. Ooh, neat. Oh. It's the silver-haired girl. I'm glad to see you're all right. Though it looks like there was nothing to worry about in the first place. Nope. I'm small and quick. These things can't lay a finger on me. Fee Clausel. Oh, yeah. Fee Clausel. Clausel. That's my name. You're just over halfway through. Keep it up. Later. How do you know? Hey, wait! Are you sure you'll be okay on your own? I'll be fine. I'm used to this. See you at the end. Ninja. What just happened? Still. There has to be something about uh, Reen wow. there. He's got some mysterious backstory. She certainly wasn't fibbing about being quick on her feet. I guess we really don't need to worry about her. Yeah, now I'm more convinced than ever that she knows exactly what she's doing. Just over halfway hmm. through? Has she already been to the exit and then come back? Well, that... Yeah, that either that or she's been in here before. One of the two. Come on, turn around. Turn around. Now's our chance. Here we go. Oh, no EP left. Treachery. All right. Can I get both of them? Yeah, I can. All right, so he uses an Eastern style of um, of a weapon. He's clearly perceptive. They've, they've kind of made that a point already. Here we go. He has that weird phrase when he was talking about how he doesn't have noble blood. Is everybody Not okay? sure I have enough to put it together yet. An A plus outcome. Hmm. chance. We can do this. Here we go. There. Leave it okay. to me. Not effective. Activate. It's my turn. My turn. Yeah. 
my turn. No, you don't need to. You can get sick to attack. My turn. Ha! All right. Oh, so little damage. But it's enough. I go where the wind takes me. music in here though. Was well, so that going to be Euless? Someone's Useless? fighting up ahead. Come on. Our young nobleman. Uh, Rain. Wait for me. Well, hurry up. <laughs> hmm, it's doing well. He knows how to use that sword. Incredible. That was really something. Damn hedonists and their mastery of swordsmanship. Judging by that display, I don't think he needs any help from us. I take it that's another school of imperial swordsmanship? Right. That's court fencing, an agile style favored by the nobility. And judging by his poise, he's no amateur. Hmm. Ha! <sighs> Did you need something? Yes, join us. <sighs> Sorry, I was just admiring your swordsmanship. Mm -hmm. I'm Reen Schwarzer. I didn't get the chance to introduce myself earlier. I I'm Elliot Craig. Guy Schwarzel, nice to meet you. I believe I have already introduced myself, but once again, I'm Yusis Alborea. And I have to say, I didn't think you had it in you. I'm impressed. What are you talking about? After all that bluster about finding your way to the exit alone, I wasn't expecting you to actually rely on others for help. I assume you came to your senses shortly after you stormed off, and then wandered back to apologize like a good boy. That is... Quite accurate. Truly, the virtue of the common man. Why, a preening noble such as myself would be far <laughs> too proud to do such a thing. You know what? As much as that 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 too is kind of a dick thing to thing, the way I uh, he pulls it off a whole lot better, and I and I feel like the only what reason he's acting like that is because of the attitude you gave him in the first place. What the hell is your problem? Yeah, it's clearly you. And your problem with him to start off with. really are all the same. So full of yourselves, it's a wonder you don't pop. And you're not just a garden variety noble either. House Alborea is one of the highest ranking in the country. I'll bet you just love looking down on us less fortunate souls, don't you? You're one to talk. I don't need a lecture in rank from the son of the Imperial Governor. Oh! Wait, what? Interesting. Oh, I thought the name Regnitz sounded familiar. The plot thickens. Karl Regnitz, the first commoner ever to hold the seat of Imperial Governor in Heimdall. The first to rule the capital. And this headstrong young lad just so happens to be a chip off that old block. Oh. Pretty rarefied air for a simple commoner, don't you think? Oh, I like this. What does that have to do with anything? Yes, my father is the Imperial Governor, but he earned that position through years of hard, honest work. Don't you go lumping him in with you nepotists who get your titles handed to you just for being born. Perish the thought. No, I mainly just regard your father as a reformist and a close friend of the Chancellor at that. <sighs> Ooh. And as you're vividly aware, his faction is in conflict with the noble faction, led by none other than the four great houses. When you look at it that way, your vitriolic disdain for the nobility suddenly seems rather cheap, wouldn't you say? You, you son of a... M Magius, don't do it! Mm, you know what? No. I... Juicy has been a dick. But I'm gonna stop Magius. I know he's taunting you, but lashing out at him isn't going to solve anything. And you, sis, don't you think that was a little uncalled for? I wasn't the one who started this. Yes, he wasn't. Let me 
Damn it, just let me go already! I'm sorry, okay? Just leave me alone for a while. You guys should just go on ahead with him. All right. Oh. I don't mind, actually. Of the two of you, I think you went a little too. I like Yusus more. Being at odds with Machias is one thing, but tracking his father into it is pretty low. You're better than that. <sighs> Perhaps I was a bit out of line. See, even as an apparent commoner, he recognizes when he is critiqued. And it would seem I still have much to learn. There we are. See, he does have humility when he isn't just being lashed out entirely on the basis of his birth. Huh? You look shocked. Why? W well, you're the son of Duke Elberea, right? I wasn't expecting the son of a noble to admit he was wrong. Ah, w wait, no, that came out wrong. I'm, I'm sorry. <sighs> There's no need to address me so formally. We may come from different social spheres, but here at this academy, we're supposed to be on equal standing. Hmm. And if you don't just lash out at him as a preconceived dick notions, he will, he'll be he'll be fair to you. Or so the idea goes, anyway. Y yeah, that's true. I, I mean, yes, I'm with you all the way there. <sighs> is class really that big a deal here in the Empire? It is. This country has a long history, and the class system has been one of its central institutions for most of that. So what are you going to do, Yusus? Maki is said to go with you, but I don't want to press you into coming along if you don't want to. I was intending to press on to the exit by myself, but I'd prefer not to mimic the actions of his ilk, so I'll accompany you. Wh what? <laughs> I I'm just surprised we're worthy of your company. Uh, uh. I mean, I'm looking forward to having you on the team. So far, um, well, I guess it's, I guess they can't have the the main PC nobles. The main character protagonist nobles be the actual horrible ones like the commoners think they are. Let's just go with that. We should get moving then. Come on. Mm -hmm. Yeah, man. Sorry, Yusus. Or not Yusus. Sorry, Machias. Yeah. Let's get him. Circular back. Mm -mm. Mm -hmm. Can I get four of you? Yeah, I can. There. Mm -hmm. Leave it to me. Mm, that's good. My turn. Oh, uh, what do you got, buddy? Hit once, impedes them, delays them. All right. Guess we'll just go with a basic attack. My turn. Very well. well it's good at that My sword. Turn. My turn. More craft. There. Leave it to me. Oh yes. So much damage. So much killing. Double kill. We sucker! My turn. <laughs> Go! And the finishing Go. blow! Well done, That's everyone. That. Let's keep moving. Great! <laughs> Ooh. There you are. Strength plus 25%, CP plus 10. All right. Useful. Nice. All right, we're going to take a little break here. Thank you all for watching. What do you think? Achaeus, Usus. I'm I'm liking Usus more. Yes, he's noble. He's been clearly raised. Well, but um Yeah, no. I think uh, he would have been respectful and polite and been fine working with everyone if he hadn't 
had the guy just be like, Oh, those hedonistic, useless wastes of space. I spit on them. <laughs> Anyways, thank you all for watching. Always. If you enjoyed things, like and subscribe. Otherwise, I'll talk to everyone later.